What's good, Eagles fans? Yo, like, <laughs> it's been a bit quiet on all that fire Howie shit, man. For real. It's been very, very quiet, for real, man. Like, I haven't been hearing the bash and all like that. I mean, I know it was it was wild on the sec. Like, I can say for the most part, at least the first. So, I mean, the people that didn't like the Jalen Rager pick, you know. But, the oh, my God, the Jalen Hurts. I'm not going to lie. I was way off guard. I was not expecting that. The only pick in his draft, I really, really disagree. Because, like I say, you don't draft a backup nor a project or something like that for the wild card. You don't do that in the second um, second round. You just don't do that. It even makes us drafting Clayton Thorson last year with a fifth-round pick. It even makes that look make sense, even though he didn't even make it in the end. But um, first of all, man, uh, I like this draft. Though. Besides besides the second-round pick, I, I kind of felt like that was a major waste. But other than that, I, I like this draft. I really did. I mean, we took in three wide receivers. We took in three linebackers. We took in one safety, two offensive linemen. All except for second round pick as far as taking Jalen Hurts. Everything else, we focused on positions that really, really needed attention. And for that, I got to give it to Howie. That was, that was a pretty damn good draft. He really redeemed himself. But what makes this draft 10 times better is the fact that we traded um, for Marquise Goodwin from the 49ers. We, we swapped a six-round pick and acquired Marquise Goodwin from the 49ers. I really I like this move. I really, really do. Um, am I saying the dude's it's, it's a lead or anything? Not exactly. I mean, I mean, we saw his numbers. He didn't really do much last year. I mean, you know, the year of the year of. Um, honestly, I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I don't even watch 49ers football to really care. To be honest with you, his his best moment was in 2017 with the 49ers. That's literally it. But um, other than that, I, I really like. I, I love the move though. Acquiring Marquise Goodwin, drafting Jalen Rager, um, uh, what's his name, John Hightower, and Quiz right, Quiz Watkins. This team is going to be. Not like it's going to be speedy non stop speedster wide receivers, and it makes us wonder what's going to happen with Deshaun Jackson. I mean, he's 33 years old. Um, look, Deshaun Jackson, you know, was definitely one of my favorite wide receivers as far as the Eagle, uh, have you know, having on his team. But the guy, the guy is definitely of that age, and you know, he always gets hurt. You know, we only played one game with us ever since he returned, you know. Let's be honest here. We went very, very young as far as drafting the three wide receivers. And what's going to happen with Alshon Jeffrey? I mean, then again, we all know the answer to that. He's definitely gone. He's definitely gone. He's not even coming back. He is gone, bro. Gone. <sighs> Probably in June. I don't know. But, uh, oh, and one more thing. When a lot of y'all were saying that Alshon was supposed to be traded, that's why I say don't believe shit. Because, uh... This draft is pretty much over, and well, it's about ten more picks left. But that might be it. That might be it for us, though, because uh, you know, in the end, we drafted ten people. You know, and that's how many picks we had. So uh, I like it. We we did a couple trading here and there. Um, we did trade with the Cowboys. I don't understand why. I understand we pity the Dallas Cowboys as always every year. You know. We, I, it's like I want to say I understand, but you didn't have to fucking bless them with that draft pick, and now they end up drafting a center, some call baby Travis Frederick. That that was I don't know. I guess not that it really matters because he's not going to stand a chance against our defensive line. So I guess it really doesn't matter. But uh, oh, and one more thing, Denzel Mims. I tried making a video. Well, I did make a video. I actually kind of forgot to mention him, so that's why I'm doing this over again. So Denzel Mims was drafted by the New York Jets. So remember when I said if Denzel Mims was afraid of Philly, you know, and the people? Remember when I said that don't get drafted by either the Giants or the Jets or the Lions, or the Bears, or the Falcons, or the 49ers. Well, guess what? He just got drafted by the Jets. And guess what the Jets play? The Jets play in East Rutherford, New Jersey. And you know what's not far from East Rutherford, New Jersey? 
Queens, Bronx, Manhattan, Harlem. Those cities are much, much more scarier than Philly. So Denzel Mims, I don't know if he did this to troll. I don't, I don't know if Denzel Mims did this to troll or whatever, but he's fucked. If you're scared of Philly, watch how it's going to turn out in New York. Oh, I deliver in New York all the time. I was just in Times Square. You think you think the people in Philly are scary? Pfft. Wait till you get to New York. You're probably going to want to quit. You're probably going to want to hire. You might want to bring mommy with you so she can hold your hand as you're walking in and out of the locker room. Just saying. Told you not to get drafted. Watch. He's going to piss his pants once he step in New York. Not, not, to, not to shit on New York. I like New York. I really do. You know, I see reality every time I enter New York. The hustle, you know, pe the hustle just, just, it's beautiful being in New York. I'm not going to lie. Like, I, 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 it's, they, it's what you call a city when you go, especially when you go in Manhattan. It's, it's what you call a city, for real. You know, going by Times Square, you know, all, so many builders, like, even when you go to McDonald's or, when you go by subway or any theater or whatever, it's just everything just so designed. It's it's I love it. I love it. I was even by a showtime at the Apollo after, you know, that video I made when the Cowboys took C D Lamb. After that video, a couple minutes later, we drove to um the our next store. It was right by Showtime at the Apollo. I just wish I took a picture. It was stupid. Ugh, I forgot. But I guess I'm I know I'll be down there sometime soon. They're probably gonna want me to go back down there, but I'll tell you one thing. It was a bitch going through uh, Lincoln Tunnel, by the way. But um, I want to say, but anyway, this is about Marquise Goodwin. This, oh, my God. I love this pick. Our wide receiving our wide receiving core was one of the worst in the NFL, especially due to injury and all of that. We just upgraded by a long shot. We went from a bunch of no-brand receivers. I believe we had Robert Davis. I can't even name the rest. That's how that's how bad it was. <laughs> but um, I, I, oh my, Eagles Nation, we're fucking loaded. We are loaded, like for real. I was mind blown with the Jalen Hurts pick in the second round, but um, other than that, other than that, you know, I like this. This was pretty good. So so what's gonna happen? Um. I guess I'm not sure if it's going to happen tonight or I don't know, but I will have a live stream, you know, talking about all of these players, their size, what they went to, you know, whatever I know about them, I'll uh, have a live stream. I, I, I could make one long video and edit and all of that, but I just really don't have time for that as much as I really, really want to, but I just don't have time for it. So, uh, yeah, anyway, um, Marquis Goodwin, great pick. You know, taking Marquis Goodwin, it makes it even makes this draft a lot brighter, you know, especially taking other wide receivers like Jalen Rager, John Hightower, and Quez Watkins. So, uh, like I say, what's going to happen with, you know, Alshon Jeffrey, Deshaun Jackson, you know, other guys like uh, who we got? Um, what's, what's the other guy's name? Uh, Greg Ward Jr. I know he's going to, he should be starting that slot, no doubt. Some of these guys might actually go practice squad, actually. They might go practice squad. Who knows? But um, I don't know if we kept Shelton Gibson. I don't know about that. But anyway, nothing never really matters. You guys, just let me know what y'all think in the comments. Uh, it is fly, Eagles fly. And uh, yeah, see y'all later.